Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm super excited about what we're gonna make today. What's more southern than Nashville hot chicken? But I'm gonna put a healthy twist on it and oven fry it. Okay guys, I'm using boneless skinless chicken thighs for my Nashville hot chicken. You can really use any cut of chicken that you like. We're going to marinate our chicken in buttermilk, pickle juice, and hot sauce. The longer you let it set, the hotter it's going to get. So we're going to do enough buttermilk to cover do our pickle juice. And then we got our hot sauce. Oh yeah. So it's best to let this sit overnight, about 12 hours. Um, the longer you let it sit, the spicier it's gonna be. Oh man, look at that red color. That's what's gonna give it that really spicy flavor. I'm gonna cover this with some foil and then I'm gonna put it in the fridge. Okay, so this is our chicken that we put in last night. Let's take a look. Oh yeah. So I'm gonna cover our pan with a little foil and then this is gonna keep it from sticking. And then I'm just gonna coat it with a little cooking spray. So the cornflakes are gonna give our oven fried chicken a super crispy texture. about two and a half cups. We're gonna see how that does. We're gonna get our trusty Ziploc baggie. We're gonna put your cornflakes in. All right. And then you're gonna take whatever, whatever you can smash them with. Just use this hot sauce bottle. And then I'm gonna do about a cup of flour. So we're going to add our cayenne pepper. So this is going to help make it super spicy and flavorful. I'm not real big on measuring, but I'm going to measure it just so I know how much to tell you guys I put in here. So that's about three teaspoons. Okay. We're going to do three teaspoons of that. I'm going to shake it up and see how it looks because the redder, the better. Chili powder. Two teaspoons of that. We got our smoked paprika. Two teaspoons of that. We're gonna put a teaspoon of kosher salt. And then we're gonna do fresh ground black pepper. However much you like. Let's shake this puppy up and see what it looks like. Okay, let's let's smell it. Oh my gosh. It smells good. Okay, so we're gonna get our chicken out of the marinade. Put it over in here, shake it up, and then we're gonna put it on our pan. We'll let it drain off a little bit. I'm gonna kind of do one piece at a time because I feel like if you put them all in there, it's not gonna, it's not gonna coat them good. Oh man, that looks good. Woo! Spicy. Tickling my nose. Oh man, this is gonna be good, y'all. Mmm. There was five pieces of chicken in here. And we probably had enough bat, like this batter probably would have done a couple more. So if you wanted to do more, you could. You could totally do chicken breasts with this. You could do bone, bone in, bone out, boneless, skinless, whatever you want. Oh my gosh, y'all. That's gonna be good. Okay. Okay guys, I'm gonna let that cook for about 25 to 30 minutes and check it. So I'm gonna make a little glaze for the top of the chicken. I'm just gonna use honey and smoked paprika so it's gonna be really sweet and have a good smoky flavor. And you just, however much chicken you made, just enough to glaze it. I think that should be enough. Do just a few shakes, smoked paprika. Oh yeah, that's gonna be sweet and smoky. Mm. 
Okay guys, let's get our Nashville hot chicken out of the oven. mayonnaise are going to cool it down just a little bit for us. I like lots of pickles. And I did put some of the honey glaze on it the last five minutes it cooked. It cooked about 30 minutes at about 375. Do our mayonnaise. It's going to help our mouths not burn like fire. Okay, I think I want this piece. Okay, oh yeah. Do a little bit more of our honey glaze on top. Okay guys, this is my oven fried Nashville hot chicken. Let's give it a try. This is probably about to be super hot and burn my mouth, but my mom always said, if you can't stand the heat, get out the kitchen. Okay, y'all wanna see if this is gonna set me on fire? Mm. Oh, it's so good. Oh my gosh, it's delicious. It's spicy. But not too spicy. It's like smoky and like sweet. Mm. 